hello guys uh, welcome to my channel and uh, today i'm going to share my experience of attending naveen's uh, automation lab uh, selenium course i took this course uh, last year and i'll be sharing my experience and uh, will it be good for you and if you are planning to enroll in the same so like the benefits and cons of uh, of this and uh, what i felt so like let's start uh, before this uh, like we can we can cover the prerequisite so my handwriting is not coming good or is it not good <laughs> so like Naveen will start this from scratch from basic Java like uh, what do you call it uh, the like JDK, JRE installation. So like the basic uh, Java stuff and he'll start from scratch. After that, like uh, he'll cover your basics of Java. This course is available on this on his website. Uh, so like you can check out that or I can share link in the description box. So you can like you can get an idea by going through the course by going through the syllabus like what all topics will be covered and uh, like 99% of the topics will be covered out of it or I should say 100% because there is something like there is always something which is left so like whatever is mentioned in the course so that is like that will be covered that I'm sure okay so the prerequisite uh, for the same is that you should have the basic understanding of uh, like manual uh, manual things how how things work and let's say your bug life cycle and everything i mean it should be it should be good if you are uh, like enrolling this course so i'll definitely recommend you to clear your manual basics and uh, because it is going to help you in like learning that it will build a base for the same and Naveen will start uh, from the uh, Java basic Java right so these are the prerequisites for the same now coming to the duration and timing so I enrolled for the like it was not a weekday batch it it, it is a weekday batch it's not a weekend batch and uh, that's uh, what is happening why is it not working this is strange or should I change my pin so yeah that's three days per week and uh, each class will take around one to one point one uh, five hour like that is 15 minutes extra so one hour and this is the duration of each class and uh, like my course was completed in 3.5 months because Naveen got COVID uh, last year so he was not available for one whole one month but I'm sure like if you are uh, like right now it's between two to three months it's not fixed like uh, whatever uh, the like the class demands uh, some because there is something like uh, some guys ask question in the class so like it can extend but uh, I'm pretty much sure like within two to three months like after two months uh, you will be in a position to give interviews and it can extend like the infrastructure part uh, can take up to three months so in between this uh, you can decide like okay now the course content like what is uh, what is that thing which uh, which like uh, which uh, why you should like take purchase this course that I mean to say like what is their extra over YouTube videos so the problem with the uh, YouTube videos uh, is that like I feel they are distorted like you you understood uh, like uh, you have learned uh, the Java from someone else you learned someone from some uh, like someone else this is from someone else and now you are learning let's say Jenkins pipeline from Naveen so I feel there is a disconnection between all three of them so it's better like if you learn all three concepts from the same person so that is uh, what I felt is missing in YouTube and one more thing regarding doubts so I think like this is covered with this part also so let's say you have any doubt so uh, like uh, in between class also you can ping him there is a uh, 
uh, zoom kind of interface although the classes are over like i'm not i'm not remembering which there was there is this application it's kind of zoom only but not exactly zoom and like in there you can ping him and uh, if it is worth it so he'll clear it otherwise like you can always shoot him a mail after the class and he will reply like okay so this is regarding like uh, why you should uh, choose this over youtube and uh, one more thing is that uh, this is this is in connection with this part is that like youtube is free so this is a, like positive and negative like whatever uh, way you uh, which you want to see that like if you pay for anything i think uh, you are more uh, serious in that and uh, also the youtube videos are available in one go and if you take uh, like weekly classes so this is like uh, let's say you take on monday wednesday and fridays okay so whatever you learnt on monday uh, you revise it on tuesday and uh, whatever you like and there is a weekend gap also so like the revision and the practice is very much important so revision plus practice and uh, in youtube videos like everything is available in one go so most of the guys lose patience that like the same story was with me because uh, like in the like after 2 uh, years i was a manual tester after after that like uh, from from my second year itself i tried to learn selenium so i was able to find the x paths okay and uh, like navigating to pages but i was still struggling with framework part and uh, so i'll tell you that uh, finding x paths and uh, like the basic stuff uh, anyone can do it so the main main thing comes uh, when you try to design your framework so that is the real struggle ultimate goal and uh, like these are the basic stuffs uh, you should uh, like know them so i also initially started uh, like watching youtube uh, videos and i was like uh, there was a rhythm lacking and uh, like there was no one to clear my doubts so that is why like if you can afford this course so if you can like um, this is right now at shit what is happening this is right now at 17k so if you can afford it i'll definitely like uh, recommend it uh, to you so this this part now the code will be available over box so there is a box drive which will be shared with you and uh, the credential will be provided and uh, you can access all all the code and recording over it so this is pretty much cool i think and uh, the i have cleared this part also like your doubts will be cleared and uh, there will be assignments also which is not mentioned here so you can put it down assignments will be provided uh, almost after two or three lectures so you have like there is no penalty in not doing it but i'll strongly recommend like this is the good part for this only yeah, like you are paying uh, the 17k so you should like uh, do the assignments and uh, there only like uh, you will face difficulty and then in the class you can discuss so this is the main difference so is it worth in switching what is this why the hell i ever wrote this sentence i'm not sure so cut it down the x factor again like uh, i think like uh, i'm not paid to like make this video uh, but still like i'll say that uh, navin is one of the best uh, tutor so his teaching experience and uh, like his way of teaching is pretty much simple and uh, this is what makes it different from like i'm not sure whether the other like is it available over uh, like other channels or not but i'm pretty much sure like there are pretty much uh, courses available over udemy so i'll definitely recommend this over udemy although the udemy one is pretty cheaper but um, still i feel like uh, i i took this so i'll definitely recommend you to go for this 
and should you take this course so if you are like uh, two years of experience and like up to 10 years of experience so i'll definitely like if you are into manual testing and planning to switch to automation and like although you have uh, like you know the basics of automation like this part and uh, you are struggling with creating frameworks and get creating pipelines so all that like will be covered the aws part like the basic aws part the ec2 so even if you know the basic uh, like framework designing so this will help you to like understand the infrastructure part by infrastructure i mean like the building the project and deploying it to git and then building pipelines and uh, automating the pipeline so all that thing that comes in the infrastructure part so like if you don't know that i'll definitely recommend you to go for this i mean the for this uh, the duration which i gave is just because like if you are very like in the beginning first year itself so you there is something some although like if you are hard working obviously like with zero experience also uh, you will be able to understand but um, i'll suggest you to like uh, hold it for a moment and understand the basic testing stuff after that uh, you jump to this course and um, the upper limit which i gave of 10 years is because after that like uh, there is no limit on, on learning so that is purely for learning okay with this i got like why i wrote this is it worth in switching by switching i mean like to change companies so definitely guys it will help you in interviews and uh, like within the videos also there are some moments uh, in which like navin told us that this is pretty much important and i have seen guys not answering this basic stuff so definitely like it will after two months like when you are at the end of your uh, course so at that time just even if you are not prepared i was also not fully 100 percent prepared but still i like um, i went for the interview i mean i gave the interview and um, i cleared it so that's why like i'll suggest you to like this was the range which i gave but like for like if you are like 12 years or 15 years and uh, you have to learn automation for your own self that way like you can always go for it but after 10 years i feel there is a certain things which are expected out of you and this much is only this much is not enough that was my intent of writing this 2 to 10 years and who should not take this course again uh, this is also important uh, because like i took some udemy courses and uh, i have like not exactly purchased course but i have wondered a lot and i have explored a lot and after that like i came to know that like this is not a red pill so by red pill this is not something like uh, you attend the classes and it will like automatically come to you it's not that way you have to watch a lecture so like let me let me scroll down a bit and uh, like i'll tell you what was my strategy again this pen is so my strategy of watching the lectures so i'm assuming like you have uh, like purchased this course and my strategy was like the first time i was watching it live and not making notes and just like uh, going with the flow going with flow and understanding like whatever i can the second time when i watch the video i make notes so that the next time it will take me less time to uh, cover the same one hour video and uh, i'll watch it again for the third time in 2x speed so that like i try to um, cram things by cramming i mean like uh, it should come automatically at the time of interview to you like you don't have to put in efforts in recalling those things so that was my strategy of watching the Naveen's video and um, so like if you are planning to just like uh, someone has suggested you or so please don't waste your time in purchasing this and uh, so what's next after this after this course uh, I'm sure you will be in a position to 
like make the framework plus uh, infra part also infrastructure part also so after this i'll like i took the rest api class and uh, by rest api i mean the restful api framework and i'll tell you in a different video from where i took this and uh, i'll get the review of uh, testing mini bytes i'm sure you guys uh, must have heard this channel name and if not please check check it out so after like taking the this course i went to this and covered the restful part and that was also a good so first and foremost like uh, i'll suggest you to give at least 6 uh, months of time okay leave it so i'll suggest you to like uh, give at least 6 months of time in understanding everything and uh, like make your own framework from scratch play with the code and all that like you should you should like feel the code that was it and uh, if you are really want to like uh, learn all that i'm sure you will find a way and i'll definitely recommend this course to anyone like for anyone who is uh, planning to learn automation and things so thank you guys for watching my video video and i hope you liked it and uh, comment down below if you have taken this course and if i have missed something or like if if you have any doubt obviously you can reach out to naveen or like comment down whatever the doubts you have i will surely help you out thank you guys for watching my video